really, 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 really want to become a, a very successful entrepreneur, uh, it, doesn't, it doesn't really have to be entrepreneurship all the time. It could be very successful, uh, let's say, mother. Let's say you just have a goal and you just want to reach that goal and you really want to get to the top of it, right? I'm going to share 12 indispensable attributes of such people, right? 12 attributes of a successful entrepreneur. You cannot, um, you can't do without them. You've got to consider them, right? So these are 12 things that I'm going to share. And number one is, I'll be very quick with this one. Um, but those are 12 attributes. of a successful let's call them 12 attributes for success right for top success actually i'll tell you what i'm going to share 10 for a reason right for just this video i'll share 10 of them and i'm gonna make these 10 and number one is have a clear vision. Now, without clarity, I mean, we could be wasting time. We, you just can't do nothing about without being clear. So whatever you want, get clear about it. Get clear as to the numbers of what you want. Let's say you want money. How much money do you want? big question you got to answer that right so number two is never complain never never complain right when you complain you kind of take responsibility away from yourself right and let's say you want to be happy and then you keep complaining about your friends you know they are making you sad that wouldn't help. The best thing you can do if you really, really want to be happy is to actually go out and be responsible for your happiness. You know, stay where you can be happy. You know, do the things that make you happy. Because if you don't, sometimes and most of the times, nobody's going to do them for you. And point number three is learn something every day. And this is something new. Daily. Learn something new every single day. This, these are the building blocks of life. I call them the building blocks of life. And why do I call them building blocks? Is because every day you add to your life, right? You add to your life. The question is, what do you add? Remember that your mind learns things even when you don't authorize, right? So it's very, very important to be in the right place at the right time or to deliberately give it the information that you want it to feed on because that's your building block. Those are the building blocks. Musicians, you know, great Michael Jackson didn't come out of um, her mother's womb and just become, you know, one of the greatest. He took steps and they were in minutes, in hours, in days, and they added up to months and eventually created a Michael Jackson. All right. So point number four is break a sweat. Very, very important. You've heard of the... Um, you probably heard of this, uh, the, the saying um, that goes, uh, motion creates emotion. You most probably heard about that. It's really true. So when you get moving, emotion, and by emotion I mean ideas, you know, things that come from within, they start popping, right? So break a sweat, do something physical, do physical exercise. It will help you. It will open up yourself for greater ideas and number five is give away that which you want to get more of right and that's five
give what you want. Give what you want. Let's say you want more money. Let's say you earn 10,000 a month. Take 10% and give it every single month. Now it's up to you. I'm not telling you what to do. You could decide on what percentages you really want to give away, right? That's entirely up to you. But whatever you want to give away, whether it's bitterness, you don't want that, right? You don't want bitterness in your life, so don't give it. So give away that which you want to get more of, right? And point number six is don't be cheap. Don't be cheap. Now, many of us have been victims, and I, I have been in that position myself, you know, where I work really, really hard. And when I go to the grocery store, I buy the cheapest food for me. And that kind of tells you that you're not really important. You don't consider yourself important. Um, <laughs> it's crazy. It's like cheating on yourself. I mean, you go to the best shop and you buy yourself the cheapest trouser, right? I mean, don't be cheap on your way up. Don't be cheap on your way up. That's one great one. And the next one is simplify everything. In everything. Simplicity, very, very important. Simplify everything. This will make you a superstar. You don't have to do everything. You know, you can outsource. You can make it simple. Make it simple for yourself. Um, I read a quote and I was, I was in a school. I was, you know, looking at some kids at one of the schools that I attended. You know, as a, I, I, I offer my services to a school. And I, I looked at one of the doors and there was um, a quotation. I think it said, uh, the easiest things, that the most important things are so simple. This is very true. Simplify everything. And point number eight is don't settle. Don't settle for cheap. Don't settle for, don't settle, all right? Don't settle for good enough. Don't settle. Don't settle for good enough. There's always more. There is always more. Keep dreaming. That's what keeps you alive. And what, that's what really, really makes you great. It's almost indispensable. Right, and number nine, I will say, don't be busy. Don't be busy. Very, very important. Never be busy. This, you've heard of the 80-20 rule and you've most probably heard, um, you know, what people have said about this, that 80% of, you know, 80-20 rule, so 80% of the results come from 20% of your efforts, of your input. 80% of your results, of the results that you get, come from 20%, only 20%. So you've just got to find out that 20% and do it to the best of your ability. Very, very, very important. And then the last one I will share is take responsibility. Because of space, I've trimmed that. Take responsibility. Very important. Nobody is responsible for your situation. Nobody is responsible for your happiness. Nobody is responsible for your financial status. As long as you keep the moment you blame others, the moment you blame anybody, even if you know they are responsible, even if you know that they have done that thing, right? The moment you blame, 
you give away your power. What is your power? Your true power is in making changes. That's where your true power is. Your power is in making changes. You can and you're able to change anything, anything. When you complain, right? Point that we talked about here. When you complain, you give away that power to make changes, right? So the point is to be responsible. So, so these are what I consider top, you know, for top success. If you want to be among the top 4%, you've heard of, um, you know, those kind of people. If you want to be among those top people, you know, top, then you've got to really, really, really make this key in your life. And I hope this helped and I hope, you know, you, you take some actions from this. I don't know what you can do about this, but the best thing to do is to remind yourself of this. And I've created a, a document with these. It's a PDF. You can download it. It's, it should be in the description. Download it. Put it on your wall. Remind yourself of these things because they are very, very important. Thank you very much. Um, bless you.